What's up everyone, Takedown here, welcome back to another video. Today we're going to be checking out some Grand Theft Auto 5 Winter Myths. Now that the winter snow is here, best way to do that is with the Santa hat. So we now have that on. Let's check out some of these myths. So the first one here is going to involve driving. Now a lot of people are complaining about the snow and driving in the snow. I am Canadian, so let's test this out and see. If it is easy or difficult to drive in the snow, I'm definitely not in the appropriate vehicle for driving in the snow. Definitely not a muscle car uh, in the snow thing, but honestly, it's not too bad. I do like that it does slide around a little bit. That makes it a little bit authentic, but it's definitely not hard to handle the vehicle in the snow. I think people are just complaining about that. Let's check out another vehicle here. I'm going to be taking out my custom Sultan, and it's one of the faster vehicles, but let's test it here and... Honestly, I must say, with more speed, it is easier to control in the snow, which is just weird, but definitely I don't see an issue with the snow, and driving in it is honestly a lot of fun right now. Let's check out another vehicle here. I did obviously crash. I had to crash. But we're going to be checking out another vehicle here, something a little bit more off-roady, and that is going to be with my Hummer. Now let's take this one out to see how it handles in the snow. Obviously, I think it's going to be great. It is heavier, it is wider, it is meant for off-road, and it is handling perfectly. Um, yeah, I don't see an issue with the driving in the snow. I do think that it is quite easy, so I'm actually going to attempt to make it. And it's not really... I'm actually attempting to make it rub out and screw up but it's actually very easy to handle even if I'm attempting to make it so uh, we're gonna be checking out some more myths right now so the first one is apparently with the updates there is gonna be snowman located around Los Santos I do see one here we're gonna see how to destroy it apparently if you destroy all 25 that's on the map you do get uh, a lot of money for it so let's check this out here I'm gonna just, get, just gonna try punching it first see what happens kicking it a little nothing so I'm gonna attempt to drive over it obviously that should work but you know with GTA graphics or physics sometimes it doesn't so we did get five grand for s destroying this snowman and there is 25 of them so that is a lot of money now we are going to be testing out something that I've tested out in the past but just on the beach here everybody is still in their summer wear they're all in bikinis they're all in their swimsuits which is crazy but let's see if these ice did form this year on the water i don't think it is because it never does obviously there's people swimming this is the first time in the winter update i've seen people swimming so just very bizarre there's snow everywhere people are still in their summer gear and swimming definitely not authentic but the ice did not freeze this year like usual so that myth is definitely busted now obviously we're going to be taking a vehicle up Mount Chiliad here and honestly it was very easy to drive up Mount Chiliad until I got to this point and I think it's the vehicle of choice. I think it is four wheel drive but it is a longer vehicle and I don't think it was one that I should have used for this purpose but it did take me a while but eventually I did make it up. Obviously if I used a different vehicle it probably would have been easier but driving up Mount Chiliad it was a little bit slipperier because of the snow but definitely nothing more challenging than normal. I'm just messing up here. and I think it's the vehicle that I chose. Definitely not the right one that I should have for this. But it still was a lot of fun to drive up Mount Chiliad. And at least with this vehicle at this point here, making it a little bit of a challenge and a little bit difficult, it did make it more interesting, a lot more fun. So maybe I did it for the best picking this vehicle. But driving up Mount Chiliad was definitely very easy to do. We're going to be checking out here now that we've got up Mount Chiliad. We're going to be destroying the last snowman. I went and got all of the rest off camera. We're going to be checking out this one here. There is one remaining. Obviously, I waited to be in uh, Town Square. And I just have a problem with these steps. So let's try to give it some speed here. Uh, we're going to destroy the last snowman and see what the extra bonus is. Just like that, we earned... 125,000 just from defeating all of them and then you earn another 125,000 from uh, destroying all of them so each one is $5,000 so 125,000 plus 125,000 
for getting all of them done. So that is 250,000 for doing that. Now, like every year with the updates, with the winter updates, they have a huge Christmas tree um, in Town me. Hall, which you guys just seen there, or Town Square. And we're going to be checking out some of the Santa costumes and different things, because apparently once you unlock all of the 25 snowman, you do get a new suit. And that is the snowman jumpsuit, which actually looks pretty cool. Now there is one more myth that we are going to be testing, and that is throwing snowballs, which I honestly completely forgot about. We also did not find the gooch. Apparently you could have that if you have $10,000 in your pocket and you're in an open session. The gooch, which is basically the Grinch, will come and find you. Three snowballs actually killed somebody, which is crazy. But yeah, we did not find the gooch. Um, die hard on top of Maze Bank. I did not get a chance to do that because it just never popped for me. So those are not included in this vehicle, but our video, but throwing snowballs at vehicles. That's crazy that that counts as basically everybody's panicking as if you are shooting a weapon at their vehicles. It's just crazy. It's just snowballs. But definitely a lot of fun. I absolutely loved this winter updates. Testing everything out, different myths. Uh, driving was honestly a lot more fun. I love driving in GTA 5 in the winter. Driving in the snow is just more fun in general for me. So I think this was definitely a great update. This guy's just coming up to me. I'm going to see how many snowballs it takes to kill him. So there's one. Two. Oh. He's trying to get away here. Three. And he's dead. Oh. Four. Five. This guy took five snowballs to kill him, which is just crazy. I'm going to throw some more, but... Hope you guys enjoyed today's video, checking out some myths for the winter update. Hope you guys are enjoying the winter update. I love the snow. I think it's a lot of fun. I love every year something a little bit more different and unique, but also keeping the same winter update elements that we all love. I was actually able to kill somebody on top of a uh, motorcycle. That is crazy. But we're going to be checking out the big Christmas trees one final time. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'll see you guys in the next one. Please take care. Peace.